Hey guys, so a lot of people have wanted me to try out doing some Overwatch guides, so this is going to be my first attempt at a character guide. The first character I want to look at is Symmetra because I feel like she's both an easy and difficult character to play. Her kit and abilities are really basic. Her primary gun is a short range, really short range beam that gradually ramps up in power the longer it stays locked on a target. Her secondary fire charges up and fires a big energy ball that travels really slowly. Her E is a 25 damage shield that can be placed on your teammates. That's it. It sounds really not that good, but someone like Zenyatta or Tracer actually benefits a lot from the shield because it means they can now survive a fully charged Widowmaker body shot, which is huge for them. Her Q is your bread and butter. It puts down a turret that can be planted on walls, ceilings, wherever you want to put it, and up to six of them can be active at a time, with the cooldown of regenerating a turret charge being about 12 seconds, with you being unable to hold more than three charges at a time. Her ultimate is a teleporter that can be set up on the battlefield and has six charges. You don't need to place her teleporter in your main respawn point and then on the field, just on the field. One in the respawn point will automatically be generated. Be sure to face it the right direction too and hide it well because it can be killed very easily. While the teleporter is active, Symmetra is unable to gain energy towards her next teleporter, which makes sense. You are also refunded part of your teleporter cost if the enemy team captures a point while it is active. So as you can see, her kit is really easy to understand. The only thing you need to actually aim is your secondary fire. Her problem is that she has really low health, low starting damage, and low combat range. However, she can be really good and should be used for locking down an area of the map on defense. It is not recommended to pick her for attack or any sort of king of the hill mode because she's just not going to be as good, not even close. She doesn't even work great on every map on defense either. For example, on defense, she's not the greatest on a map like Route 66 because a lot of it is outside, it's very open, there's not a ton of places to put a bunch of turrets and she generally won't be able to engage as well as she could on other maps. A couple of maps I really like Symmetra on are Hollywood and Numbani because there are a lot of places that you can choose to lock down. Combat for Symmetra is very simple. As long as you're latched onto someone and they remain in your vision, you're going to hit them. The damage slowly ramps up over 3 seconds, starting at 30 DPS, then 60, then 120. This makes fighting characters like Tracer and Genji, anyone who is fast, really simple because their erratic movement won't affect your damage as long as you maintain sight of them. If you're not beaming people, you should be firing as many energy orbs towards choke points as you can. Energy orbs will penetrate Reinhardt and Winston shields, which is awesome for poking at the enemy team, but are otherwise unreliable at range. You basically need to hope people walk into them. Something you should try to get used to is charging up a blast around a corner, then if you know someone is near you, get close to them and try to blast it in their face for 125 damage to initiate a fight. That'll take some practice. We're gonna take a look at Numbani for this gameplay. Getting out to set up turrets quickly is a vital part of Symmetra. You want as many turrets up as you can before the game starts. Ask your team what kind of defensive position they're going to hold at first because you shouldn't exactly be on the front lines by yourself. In this game, we decide we're going to start pressure right up in the first building, so I start setting up there. Set up your turrets high and spread them out. You want to make it as difficult as possible for the enemy team to kill your turrets, and while getting damage on people is nice, it's not as nice if they can just easily kill all of your turrets in a couple of shots. I also like starting aggressively because it gives me more of a chance to charge my ultimate, and getting your teleporter up as soon as possible is incredibly vital to good defense. The game starts out decently. We burn about a minute of their time in the beginning part of the map. Most of my turrets are dead, and I'm realizing that not a lot of my team is still here, so it's time to abandon ship and find a new place to set up. You, as Symmetra, need to have good game sense. You need to realize when it's time to give up a position and fall back, because it's more important for you to set up another strong defensive position than it is trying to salvage an old defensive position. Luckily, Reinhardt goes for the pin and not the easy smack to the face, so I'm able to escape. I should have left here a lot sooner than I did. So the next defensive position is going to be the next building back. I personally like to start closer to the doorway, then gradually back up. Don't let them have that space for free, especially when you have three turrets that you can put up right away. 
Lucio gets super low here and baits in the Winston, and luckily Lucio grabs the heal in time, meaning we can go on the offensive, since the AoE healing of Lucio is going to be able to keep us up long enough to take on Winston. My gun charges to level 3 during this, and I just suck his life away with the help of my turrets. Typically, Winston is a huge counter to Symmetra, but this isn't a fight that was going to end quickly for him. What I'm doing here is really not that smart, because Reinhardt at any moment could have just clocked me twice in the head and I would have been done. But in order for Symmetra to really do stuff, you need to be good bait. She's squishy as hell, which is typically bait enough. Roadhog, instead of focusing me, works on killing my turrets. He burns three shots killing them, which is a lot of DPS lost and takes a lot of time to do compared to other characters. In the meantime, Lucio is jumping around and our Ryan charges in, but unfortunately gets stunned. However, we've done a lot of damage to them because Tobiorn has set up his turret directly behind me, so they're in the perfect spot to just eat a ton of damage. I slowly back up launching Energy Blasts, which go through Reinhardt's shield. If they want to progress, they gotta eat a lot of my damage, making this area really, really good to hold down. It's a nice choke point, there's not a lot of room for the enemy team to move in. My constant energy blasts end up paying off big as I rack up four eliminations over a few seconds. This teleporter placement is really high risk. It's pretty easy to kill by someone flanking, especially since we don't have anyone monitoring this angle at all. Once again, game sense is important. The enemy team doesn't really have many flankers, and we've been maintaining pretty good control thus far. If you're worried about your teleporter, place some turrets around it to make it a threat. Another good place for the teleporter would have been downstairs in the hallway, also aggressively placed, but maybe a little harder to get to because it's on the same floor that we are fighting on. Let's look at a small team fight now. The best thing you can do as Symmetra in a team fight is don't fight. Seriously, let everyone else get engaged, let the enemy find their main targets, let your team decide who they're going to fight, then go in. Symmetra doesn't last very long when she is noticed. In these next two team fights, I stay away until both their tanks have decided on targets, then I just go in on whatever I can hit. If there's a Mercy, lock onto her right away and take her down. She'll drop really quick. Here's a turret interaction. My first three turrets are very well placed, on the wall behind the door frame. It's not easy to see them, you need to walk in to actually see them, which means you're going to take damage. The next three are not well placed at all. They're on the ceiling, very visible to the other team. Reaper comes in, sees the turrets on the ceiling, and kills them, then walks in thinking he got everything. He immediately gets blasted and uses his escape while I'm beaming him. Mercy comes rushing in to help, but gets tagged for about 100 damage and I go in for the kill on Mercy, thinking that I can take both of them. Mercy goes down and my beam is on level 3, so I immediately drop Reaper as well since he can't shift out of the way. Unfortunately, two more enemy players gang up on me and kill me, but this was a great 2v1 win regardless. Reaper was baited really hard and it ended up giving me the 2v1 and possibly the win. If Mercy was still up, she might have been able to res people, letting them take the point. Symmetra is a really simple character to understand, but to take advantage of what she's capable of takes a lot of game sense and knowledge. It also takes a tremendous amount of patience. You can't rush trying to get kills with her, and you shouldn't be playing her to get kills specifically. Her beam range is stupidly short, and she is otherwise really vulnerable, having no escape at all and very slow movement. Stick to tight spaces, buildings, and hang around your turrets. Use yourself as bait and try to get people to come fight you on your terms. If they don't want to, that's fine, because you're actively preventing the enemy from coming through. The biggest part of Symmetra is actually knowing when to play and not play Symmetra. If you're getting rolled over by the enemy team, then Symmetra is not really going to be helpful. She can't really carry a team to victory. If a team captures the first point and they gotta push the payload, generally it's not a bad idea to switch characters because trying to set up defenses and teleporters gets much harder with a moving objective. Symmetra can counter a lot of those fast moving characters, but she's no match for people who can take down her turrets really quickly, nor is she really great against tanks. Winston and Soldier 76 are really efficient at killing your turrets, same with Tracer, although Tracer will take a lot of damage doing it. Any characters with Reach, Widowmaker, Hanzo, Roadhog, Farah, even Genji if the Genji knows how to kite will give you problems, along with McCree and Rit- Basically everyone who can deal moderate damage from outside the range of your gun will give you problems, which is almost every character in the game. This is why she can feel tough to play. She has what feels like a lot of counters and her range is among the shortest in the game. She needs to be played aggressively, but not too aggressively otherwise you just die. 
Here's another game on Hollywood, I'm not going to commentate this one. Just watch how I handle the match in general, never straying far from my turrets, always staying back, basically being the lookout and only taking fights when I know I'll stand a very good chance of winning. Symmetra also actually relies on having a good team as well. If your team is not really able to hold the enemy, then it's very difficult to hold down one choke point when everyone else is pouring into another. Enjoy the gameplay guys, I hope this was helpful in some way, and I will see you next time. Who needs defense anyway? Yeah, it's just, it, we're just playing on defense. We don't need defensive heroes. No. Ooh. So my turrets are, at, are in these bushes right here, by the way. What? In these bushes. Oh, that's... That's evil. Cool. Buff this Hanzo. Hanzo, come back. Boom. 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 That tracer. Place. He's coming in right here. Two tracers, I think. Yep, it's two. It's Cause that's not annoying as fuck. She's almost that's dead not. in our back room. Hunt. Nice. Oh, I still haven't oh, played the game yet. In the hole. I'm gonna keep putting the turrets in here. Oh, I thought oh, Roadhog was still here. I have an offensive, uh... Thank you for letting me charge my ult. <laughs> the offensive Torby ones are crazy. Ah. Tracer's coming in again. Yep. I'm just trying to bait her, bait her into the, uh... Got D.Va out of the bot. I got teleport up. Oh, I'm gonna go plant it. Yep. They're on the point. The Still on the point. Oh, she... She did that just to destroy your turrets. Can oh, use or whatever. Well, now I got more. D.Va? Yeah, no, don't worry, I counter D.Va fucking hard. Ow. more sentries. Hey, Chris Rabiani, thank you very much for... Ah. Got her. Oh, get eaten by my turrets! That was funny. I hate railings. Holy shit. That's molten core. Who's, is that ours? No. We don't have that. Take that. Nice. Letting dragon consume me. Dragon has consumed me. I repeat, dragon has consumed me. Pinky. Uh, would you like to? Would you like some heals? As well? Oh, you gotta be shitting me. There's a. I heard a tracer just flipping around. <laughs> Alright, teleporters got three charges left. I heard SRL is next week. Is that true? I would have to ask you what that's based on. Yeah. Am I turning 27 this year? I am indeed. Watch, they're charging. They're charging. Yeah, I think I'm multiple divas now. That's multiple divas. I died. Multiple. <laughs> Two divas, yeah. Aimbot. That hit me. Come to the I stairs if you want uh, protection. I. I. I out healed it. Good. Yeah, we're good. I'm just saying in general, because they're going to be hitting those turrets now. Two charges left on teleporter. Oh my god. Oh. Letting dragon consume me. I have been consumed by the dragon. Fair player and paragon? Feng Mao. What's up, Ivan the Great? How are you doing? My teleporter is offline. I'm hearing Tracer somewhere. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's bad. That's bad. 
Okay, hammer down. Yeah, that, that was bad. That was bad. I gotta jump right up. Camera up, yep. I am. Yep, they're on the point. Oh, get I can't owned do much. by my things. I am super far away. Soldier down. Going on Mercy. Oh, Mercy fuck. down. Yeah, I, uh, I think oh, the no, no. server just started lagging for a second there, because I just, my MS just went up there. No, my god, I was making the plays! I made so many plays! <laughs> That's an oh, the right tracer. There. Oh lord. Oh, I'll lord. come back with teleporter if we can hang on. No. Nice dragon. Hey, healers Discord. Healers Discord. Nice. Reinhardt's Discorded. No, no. Swap the pair. Swap the pair. Nice. Okay, good. Go. Good job. Nice job. <laughs> what a decent Symmetra game. 19 eliminations as Symmetra. Nice. Top of the leaderboard. Nice. I don't ever have I know when this was. <laughs> <laughs> yup. <laughs> Pretty good. Vote for myself. Vote for myself. <laughs> myself. Did I ever read To Kill a Mockingbird? I did. I'm sure I did in the past. Bing, bing. Not bad. I got Symmetra. most healing. Not bad. 